Well, you can ask um, President Jack Dew and President Ramatar why they appointed Major General Singh mm -hmm. to his present position, uh, why they appointed uh, Colonel Chabila Ramsroop to CDC, why they appointed um, um, Colonel Brassington Reynolds as a judge, um, why they appointed uh, Colonel Passad as the Accountant General, and you can go through a whole list of people. When I became president in May 2015, there had about 10 officers that the, um, that the PPP administration had appointed. President David Granger made that statement during his recent public interest show at the Ministry of the Presidency. President Granger had appointed retired Brigadier Bruce Lovell to conduct a commission of inquiry into corruption allegations made against the Customs Anti-Narcotics Unit, KANU. Retired Colonel Windy Argonen was assigned to conduct a commission of inquiry into a recent deadly fire at the Children's Drop-In Center, and serving Colonel Nazul Hussein has been appointed to head the Department of National Events of the Ministry of the Presidency. The opposition People's Progressive Party Civic PPC has been shided these appointments, among others, as a sign of the growing militarization of the state and government apparatus. But President Granger said these criticisms are unnecessary. These are human beings. These are people with skills. You know, they're not a separate breed of, of, of citizens. We can't deprive them of their rights if they have the talent, the experience, the qualifications. Um, why not? I don't di discriminate against them. And obviously, Mr. Jagdeo, Mr. Ramatar didn't discriminate against them because I inherited a large number of former military officers who had been appointed by the PPP administration. I don't see that anything could be wrong in asking a colonel here or a brigadier here to do a commission of inquiry. The question is, are they competent to do it? Mr. Granger then rebuked the former PPC administration for the criticism of his appointment decision. You know, there's the old saying that it doesn't matter if it's a black cat or a white cat. If it catches rats, it's a good cat. <laughs> so we like want good cats. Most of the appointments are mainly on experience and competence. That is right. And this, I don't think is different. Everybody recognizes that some of the appointments made by the previous administration, uh, nobody criticized them. Why should they criticize me? Mm. I would certainly make some criticism myself because there's a particular person who they appointed as a minister who was cashiered from the GDF, discharged mm. with ignominy, mm. and they put him in the cabinet. So when the people in the PPP point fingers, um, let them explain why such a person was given such a high position in their administration. In a statement last week, the PPC said that the Granger administration has a proclivity for placing retired and serving military officers in government agencies and departments and to head commission of inquiry into one incident after another. But President Granger believes that competency, honesty and qualifications are what will get his vote of confidence to get the job done. Back to you, Rihanna.